Zion, kids learning. To one quacky, I'm coming to get you. Where's Quacky? Look around, is Quacky here? Oh, you're showing your big head. Oh, you're showing your big head. Hey, you're showing your tail, wear it. Ha ha I found you this time, I did not show anything. You are showing your shadow, a shadow, where is it? Hello, shadow. Oh, the shadow is gone, wacky, don't worry. Hey, look, a flashlight. With this flashlight, you can find your shadow again. Really, let's go to the lab and try it out. Practice your hands and brain. Let's create together to the laboratory. Let's go. How is the shadow created? Let's set up the items first. If you don't like it, Toy robot next, let's start the experiment. I don't see the robot shadow. Turn on the flashlight to give it a try. Wow, a shadow has appeared. A shadow only appears when there is light. Then try to move the robot left and right. Move it outside the beam of light. How the robot's shadow has disappeared again and then move it in front of the light. The shadow has reappeared. Got it when the robot stands in front of the flashlight. The shadow will appear. You are right. Quacky blocks the light. And then Quacky's shadow appears. As long as the light is blocked in front, there will be a shadow. However, some items do not have shadows, wow. Who doesn't have a shadow? Let's give it a try. Put them in front of the light. Building block. To a ball transparent glass piece. Did you notice? Which item doesn't have a shadow in the light? The yellow block has a shadow. Correct answer. The transparent glass piece doesn't have a shadow. Transparent objects don't have shadows. Shadows appear only when light shines on opaque objects. Hey. Hey, Quacky is not transparent, so Quacky has a shadow. Why does the shadow move around? Kids, do you know why? Let's explore together. Which toys do you want to see the shadow of? Pinwheel. Rubber duck. Robot. Move the flashlight left and right along the dotted line and see what happens to the shadow. The shadows can be long and short for a while. As the flashlight moves, it changes the direction of the light. When the light changes, the shadow follows. It turns out that by moving the flashlight, you can make the shadows move around. That's right, when the light source moves, the shadow will change. 
Shadows are fun. Go play with your shadow friend.